So this video is still on the chapter of determinants and we are going to uh, see some properties of uh, determinants. I'm going to use here a 2x2 two two matrix right, with entries A, B, C and D and and then you will see what happens if the matrices are not uh, dimension 2 by 2 um, following the, the properties. Okay, we saw in previous videos that the determinant of this uh, matrix you simply do A times D minus BC. Okay, so that is the determinant of matrix A. So at the end of the day, the determinant is nothing but a map that takes from the, the space of n by n matrices with entries uh, in the reals to the reals. Okay, where to each matrix A, we are going to map it into a real value called the determinant of A. Okay, so at the end of the day, the determinant is a mapping. Okay, of a, a function. Okay, we are not going to get into this. We are simply, we are quickly going, we are jumping to the, the properties of this determinant 2x2 two two and deduce for some other dimensions. Okay, so we get directly into the first property. The determinant changes sign when two rows or two columns are exchanged. This is easy to see. If we pick, for instance, the identity in the 2x2, two two, right? Let's call this, well, let's call it the identity, that's what it is. So the determinant of the identity will be 1 times 1 minus 0, that will be 1. Okay, let us change the columns here. Let us say we now have 0, 1, 1, 0. Okay. If you take the determinant here, uh, what shall I call this? I don't know. I'm going to call it B. Okay. The determinant of B will be 0, minus 1. Right. Here you are. So if you change two, um, if you change two lines, right or if you change two columns okay the determinant changes sign okay you had one and now you have minus one and obviously you can see this in a b c d let us call this matrix a i'm using determinant and this sign it's exactly the same a d minus b c if you let us do a prime and put cd here and ab here okay the determinant of a prime will be cb minus ad you see so um, here you have ad minus bc here you have CB minus AD. So the determinant change sign, changing two rows. And now that we saw this determinant of identity, 1, 0, 0, 1, we saw that, that the term, determinant is 1. And that is also a very obvious property of determinants. So the determinant of the identity matrix is always 1 for any dimension, okay? If you have uh, 0, 1, any dimension, right, this being the identity, so the determinant of this matrix will be 1, okay, for any n 